Good evening everyone and welcome to my channel. If you're brand new to my channel, my name's Elizabeth. My channel name is Shy Town Girl. I hope everyone is doing well on this, what is it? I don't even know what day of the week it is. I think it's Tuesday, Tuesday evening. Um, I have a brand new Dollar Tree. I keep, you know, it's like, how, what do we say now? Dollar 25, buck 25. I have a haul from the dollar store. How's that? <laughs> um, there's some fun finds in this haul, some Valentine's Day stuff, some brand name items, some staples for the house, and just some fun finds. So I'm gonna jump right into it. I hope everyone is doing well. Okay, um, I am an iced tea person. I love my Lipton iced tea, and if I can find a brand name, um, I grab it at dollar store. Um, this is 4.7 ounces. All you do is pour this into a pitcher. You don't need to add sugar or anything. There are two different flavors. There is the Lipton iced tea in the Southern Sweet Tea, and then there's Lipton just regular iced tea. So there's two different kinds in the store. So make sure you pay attention to that front part there because there is a taste difference. I happen to like the Southern Sweet Tea better. I don't like a lot of lemon flavor in my iced tea and I feel like all the iced teas usually have quite a bit of lemon flavor and that's just me. So I really like this one and it's convenient pouches to just, you know, toss in the trailer when we were at the track or for whatever at home. Convenient, toss it in, add water, you're done. Another brand name, but a staple in the house. Um, even to pay $1.25 for this, it's still not that bad of a buy. Uh, depends on where you go. So 7.25 ounces is the original size for Kraft macaroni and cheese. Needed a couple in the house, so I just picked up two boxes of that. Picked up two more boxes of the Minute White Rice. This is seven ounces. This is perfect for just me. Like if I have rice with a meal and then I'll take the rest of the rice, um, I'll cook the whole box and I'll make the other half and turn it into rice pudding, which is just basically sugar, milk, the rice, throw it in the oven at 350, put it in a little pan. Um, so seven ounces. So I grabbed two packages of those and that's Minute Rice. So that's brand name. Another brand name find, which I've never even seen these in the store yet. General Mills, um, you do have box tops that are good. This is good till April 29th of 2022, and it's Apple Cinnamon Checks. So, yeah, I'm interested to see what this kind of tastes like. Um, I won't be buying any extra cereal at the moment um, due to the fact that Grandpa can't have it. So, I'm just, you know, getting like a box for myself. So, I grabbed one box of that, which I thought was a great find. This I really wasn't sure about, um, but it's called Love Corn. It says, P.S. We're crunchy, we're delicious. Salt and vinegar. Hey, we're a delicious, gluten-free, vegan, premium, crunchy, love corn. So you can use it on the go with a beverage. It could be a crunchy topper. Um, 4.5 grams, so 1.6 ounces, salt and vinegar. I thought that was kind of fun. Love corn. Like if you're putting a package together or something for somebody from using all dollar items, dollar store items, you can put this in there because it's love corn. And see how you got the hearts there? I just thought it was funny for like Valentine's Day. But ever since I saw it, I've been going, love corn. I know, wacky. Lack of sleep, lack of everything. Um, okay, Scotty's Tissue, which is a brand name, 148 in the box. Just needed some tissues in the house. So I grabbed a package of those. I've been going through so much tissue, it's unbelievable. Um, you guys can probably imagine why. Okay, so let's step into... <laughs> I did get, oh, I'm throwing my stuff all over the place already. I did find a couple new candles, so I grabbed them. These are by Wellness Collection, and they're three-ounce candles. I'm actually going to take this one out of the package here. So I got four different scents with four different colors. Three ounces, again, in these glass jars that are reusable. Mmm, it's like a tangerine scent. It smells really, really lovely. So I grabbed one of those, which I'm probably going to actually put that and light that up this evening. I also grabbed this one here. What is the scent? Wait a minute. Okay, what? It says scentist, but it's not... Oh, 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 my bad, my bad. Okay, so duh. This one is Tranquil Scent. It's like right in front of my face. Very soft, like the smell of fresh rain. Then this one is Soothing. I don't even know how to pronounce this word. I'm bad. I don't like to say words I can't pronounce. I'm going to give it a shot so guys don't laugh at me too hard. Um, Apa Santis? I have no idea. There's the word right there. 
So you guys have to let me know. I'm not sure. It's a beautiful lilac color and it almost smells like a lilac a little bit. The last one is called Healing Gersion. Woo, it's got definitely a coconut smell. I love that. I don't tend to smell candles in the stores too much because number one, I don't really think you get a fair, sh uh, a fair share, a fair smell of what they smell like. And I also feel like there's so many other funky smells going on in the stores. Like, I don't know. I, I just kind of, that's just my rule of getting candles. Um, I don't know. Call me weird. Okay. This was kind of neat to find. These were in the party section. They were up front and they had an end cap made of them. And they're calling them trifle containers, which you could definitely put a trifle in here. Or you could use them for bubblegum balls or candies or anything. They're so pretty. I just had Rizzo. Let's see. <clears throat> they stand from the stand up. They're five inches high by six inches in width. So this one is in this lovely lilac color. It's so pretty. Your stickers do come off. Thank goodness. Fill it up with treats. Use this to put something in it for Easter, for Valentine's Day, for Mother's Day for anything you want to use it for. They also, so they had it in this purple. And then I found one in this pretty pink. Now I'm not sure how well this is going to come across on camera. But I think you can tell that that's pink. So there's the pink one. There's the purple one. So they had this shape. But then they had this shape as well. But this I found in blue. And it's shaped, well, let me slip it on this. That's just a sticker right there. It's shaped like this with this scalloped edge all the way around. Perfect for making a candy arrangement or a bouquet arrangement for someone. Six inches in height by four inches in width. There you go. So I got blue. I got actually two in blue. And then they had this beautiful pink. Perfect, like if you have someone that's going to be having a baby shower and if you don't know, you could do pink and the blue. Or if you do know, you could do whatever color, you know, works best. So pretty for like souvenirs or just decorations on the tables. Lots of things. I mean, anybody that's ever done any kind of decorating, which I have, knows how expensive decorations can be. And I'm the one that goes for everything. I have to have the, the balloons. I have to have the streamers. I have to have, you know, I'm just a fanatic for that stuff. I have to have table scatter. So it can get quite expensive. <clears throat> so if you can get most of your supplies at Dollar Tree, it's definitely helpful. Okay, so let me see, what do we got here? These I found in the car section, and I'm assuming because they're meant to be little garbage cans for your car. Isn't this cute? So you push the lid in. I thought that was so funny. So the tops come off, and I'm assuming you could use it for, maybe for those that smoke. I don't know, maybe if you want to put your butts in there after they're out because you don't want to put it in plastic. But these are kind of fun, or you could put it on your desk or wherever. They're six and a half inches in height. I found one with this green topper, and then I found one that was all in black. They had yellow, they had blue, they had green, yellow, black, blue. I wanna say there was one more color, but I just can't remember off the top of my head. Then I saw in the same section where those were, in the doggy section, the or you could use this for a kitty cat, you could use it for any kind of animal, a collapsible bowl that comes with this little clasp that you can hook on the uh, leash or on anything that you carry with your dog at the time, but you just pop, actually let me take it apart and I'm gonna show you. This is so handy. So if you're out walking and the dog gets thirsty, I don't let um, any of my dogs like drink from puddles if I can avoid it at any time. I mean, they do, it happens, but I like to give her fresh water. So if you want, you know, it's just looks like a little flying saucer, but all you do is pop it out like that, fill it with water, and there it is. It sits flat on the ground. When you're done, bloop. It's almost like, wait a minute, bloop. Wait, um, they're too low. They don't sit up here anymore. <laughs> or they could be earmuffs. <laughs> Or it could be a little, you know, wow, this looks like Devo. No, you know what this looks like? The monkey that plays. <laughs> okay, 
I have to admit, I've had a little bit to drink tonight. No, I'm just kidding. I'm not. I'm tired. I'm just tired. Anyways, collapsible bowl. How cool is that? Perfect. Hey, if you got a kid in the car and needs a drink and the dog has a drink out of it yet, why not? Right? Okay. I'm just joking about the kid. Well, I guess if a dog hasn't drank out of it, you could do that. All right. Another brand name and a very expensive brand name too. Dr. Scholl's. That dude must have made so much money by now. I can only imagine. All right, so these are American Lifestyle Collection Dr. Scholl's Ball of Foot Cushions. Two pairs. A buck? Seriously? Seriously? And this is the brand name Dr. Scholl's? I have to look these up online and check how much a pair of these go for online. Because I know it's more than $1.25. I was like, wow. It's going to take me a while to get used to that $1.25. I'm just so not used to it. So I picked up two packages of those. And then this one, which is just the Assured brand, which is pretty much Dollar Tree's version. But these are a set of heel cushions, which I thought, you know, every now and then, sometimes I'm on my legs for really, really long periods of time. And I'm just like, ugh. I think at this point, anything would help. I've been doing a lot of stairs and things like that. And, you know, as we get older, we have more aches and pains. So I grabbed a pair of these. But if you can find the Dr. Scholl's ones, I would say grab them because, yeah, you're getting two pairs in there. You can't beat that price. You just can't beat it. All right, moving along here. Let me just uh, pull some stuff forward. My bad, my bad. All right, I went down the... Actually, no, let me stop over here first. I went down the um, section where you have your makeup and things like that and beauty. This is by Dr. Fresh. It is a soft Dr. Fresh turbo-powered free replacement head and you even get an ever-ready battery. How's that? Now, obviously, it's not like one of those big fancy ones, you know, that you would spend, you know, a lot of money at in the store. But if you're traveling and you don't want to bring that expensive one, what a great alternative, which would be to use that. So I thought that was a great buy. And the fact they gave you the battery when they really didn't have to. This is something I'm thinking is a brand name as well. And I'm not 100% sure, so don't quote me on that. But it's called an, is it Axis? Anus? Anus Grip? Okay, I'm not cutting that out. Axis grip. It grips anyways 360 degrees. That's what it looks like. I am pretty sure to say that, um, I don't know, obviously it shows an Apple phone on the back, but I'm pretty sure it's called Axis Grip. Magnetic mount compatible. The grip that does it all. So that's what it looks like. So I thought that is definitely worth more than a dollar it was worth more than, excuse me a buck 25 oh i'm gonna get that through my head at some point it's so hard to get because dollar tree's been dollar tree for like ever all right i had to get a new glue gun because my old one bit the dust after like i don't know that thing's got to be 30 plus years old i thought you know for a buck i'm just gonna give it a try so i picked up one of the crafter squares it takes the regular size glue sticks, so I grabbed a pack of the glue sticks as well. So for $2.50, you get a bag of sticks and a gun, and I don't know. I'm going to check it out. How many of you have ever tried the glue gun from Dollar Tree? Let me know down below what you think, if you liked it, if you didn't like it. I'm curious to know what you thought about it. All right, moving on. Oh, this is just a cute little find. You guys know how I love my pens, and if you've seen my pen collection, they're like, I probably have about at least 100 pens. This one's a new one to add to the collection. It's made by Jot. It writes in black ink, and it is, look at that big old fuzzy pineapple. So it's all fuzzy down here. Then you have these glass, it's like a big pom-pom ball. It's done in yellow. This was the only style that I found. Um, they all write in black. There was no other colors that I saw anyways. Picked up a package of these placards. You get 60 in a package, which is a great buy with the mint flavor. So if you got goobers in your toofies, you can use those. This was a great find. I got a couple of these actually um, to put in the race trailer because we're always getting hacked up at the track. This is by Care Us Value Kit Wound Care Kit. All in one solution, good for large wounds. You're gonna get all these things that are listed in this package come in this box which I thought, wow, that's just perfect. You get a little bit of everything and look at how nicely everything is bagged. Everything is bagged up and sealed. Your tape is even protected. Um, your gauze pads that you get, I mean, for the $1.25, and I know I just said a buck again, 
My bad. It's going to take some time. For the dollar twenty-five, you can't beat it. Nice to have something in the trailer at home, a quick little kit, just keeping your car for emergencies. You never, never know. Okay, another fun find, which I know is definitely worth more than a dollar twenty-five. This is a hard protective camera case. And oh my gosh, it's in purple. You know what sucks is I don't really carry a camera. Who carries cameras anymore except for probably professional photographers? Um, oh, it's got one of those silicone packs, which I'm going to get rid of that right away. I hate those things. With kids and dogs, you got to be careful. Um, who really carries cameras anymore? But you know what? I still have a camera that would fit in this. And actually, my camera's pink. So this would fit perfectly in there. It's even got a belt clip on it. It's a heart protective case made by Elfine. Again, you know, it says fits most digital cameras. It's a good size. I know $1.25, it's definitely worth more of that. But again, who carries cameras anymore? Four and a half inches by three inches. And there it is. It's a beautiful dark purple. But I'm going to put my pink camera in there. Why not, right? I don't use it very often, but why not? Okay, what else did I find? Let's take, oh yeah, I was a bad girl. I think I had the munchies when I went in. All right, I'm guilty of some Three Musketeers, some Twix bars, and this is a super fun find. Who doesn't love horrible snack bears? Okay, 100th anniversary. <laughs> Share size horrible gold bears, pineapple, four ounce. Pineapple, has anyone ever seen pineapple ones before? I know I haven't. These are good until January of, I can't even read the date, my bad, 2022. Um, so plenty of time to be munching on the, wait, best before January of 2022? Oh, well that would be why they're at Dollar Tree. Buck 25, OMG. I should put like a quarter every time I say that wrong in a jar, I'd be one rich bitch. All right, so four ounces in pineapple, and they're sealed, so they're still good. And then we have blue raspberry. I didn't even know there was a blue raspberry. That just looks so cool. And these are good till December of 2022. So I have a whole year before these are expire, so have to eat these first, I guess. Okay, um, I was going down... The aisles, and this was just hanging on an end cap, so I couldn't really tell you where I found these at. They were just on an end cap, but these are for St. Patrick's Day. Shenanigans with my nomies. There it is. Now, I know I've said this a million times, and this is just my opinion and my opinion only. I did get two of them. In my opinion, these are wonderful to hang on your drawers, hang on your refrigerator, hang in your, in your kitchen or wherever for decorative purposes. But for drying um, a plate or a cup, forget about it. It's never going to happen. It will not absorb water. I don't know. Maybe I just hit my camera. Maybe it's just me. But those things do not absorb water for nothing. Nada. I, oh, they get me so frustrated. So I finally said, you know what? If I get them, I have to just remember to use them for decorative purposes only. Okay, these are so cute. OMG. I've already showed you some Valentine's Day socks, but they were like um, crew socks. These are knee-high socks, and they're so cute. This one says, you and me, and it's coffee and donuts, and that's probably what I need is a cup of coffee. How cute are these? And these are knee-high, so you got lots tucked behind you there. And then I found this pair of knee-highs, and there's no Oh my gosh, so now I have a crew size set and I have a knee high set in Nomi. So I thought that was super cute. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, what else I got? Oh, yeah. Down the Valentine's Day aisle. Some, in my opinion, some of the sweets there are good. Some of them are brand names and they're very, very good. And you have to just watch out for them. I get these every year. I get them for Christmas. I get them at Valentine's Day. They also do bunnies at Easter time. These here, you get four in a package. And these chocolates are from Germany and Poland. And they are absolutely lovely. They're all individually wrapped. And what I do is I'm going to take them apart. And I'm going to show you some of my tiered tray. If you haven't already seen it on Instagram or Twitter. And I'm going to put some of these on my carts that I got from Target. Um, once I take them out of the package and put them up for display, 
they're hard to keep there because they are very, very yummy. So if you're wondering about those, they're really, really good. Uh, moving on. This was a fun find. I thought, oh, you know, I've already sent Mary Ann's um, giveaway out that she won. So she should be getting that any day now. She's going to really enjoy that, I hope. Okay, I thought, oh my gosh, if I had found these sooner, I would have added these into the giveaway for Valentine's Day. But I just found them now. So maybe that means we need another giveaway. Hmm. Let me know down below if you're still watching. Okay, so this was super cute. This is, it's not going to give me an ounce on here. Okay, so I'm not going to worry about that because it doesn't give me what it is in here exactly. This says vegan and cruelty free, cooling and refreshing peppermint face mask, cooling mint and is it, I don't even know how to pronounce that. So I'm not going to try because I'll mess it up. So isn't that cute for Valentine's Day? Look at all the balloon hearts. They also had this one here that is soothing and moisturizing ice cream face mask, creamy milk and honey. I love the packaging. It's so pretty for Valentine's Day, especially if you're doing a basket. They also had this one here. Mm. I always make chocolate covered strawberries for Valentine's Day for myself because they're too damn expensive. Um, this one here is chocolate and strawberry face mask. Ooh la la. And last but not least, there was one more. I was going to say flavor. I love this packaging. It's the front of a cupcake and it's called Cupcake hydraulic acid and vanilla but look at that beautiful cupcake it's like taken from the top and shot down isn't that lovely looking isn't that just pretty if you have all these right here what a great gift i mean that would be five dollars right there but that alone with a card to somebody what a wonderful treat okay they also had brand name again this is palmer's cocoa butter and formula with vitamin e it's a step one and step two hair mask. I thought, well, I definitely need that. I need a haircut. I need a whole bunch of stuff done. Uh, that's all on the back burner for right now. I got more priorities going on. But this is by Palmer's, and it's Palmer's Cocoa Butter Formula with Vitamin E. Again, it's a two-step. You just tear it in half. You use your step one and step two. So that should be exciting. It is for basically deep conditioners and moisturizing, and it's also silicone-free. And you can use it if you have regular hair or chemically treated hair. It does not matter. So it's safe. Um, the only other thing I did grab down the craft section was another set of crafter square brushes. You get three in a package. I've been doing some painting here and there on not walls, but on arts and crafts. Down the toy aisle, I came across this little... I think it's by Orbs. Uh, no, it's by Carab... No, it's, it says it's a carabiner, which, yeah, that's a carabiner. But it's got a little rubber ducky on the bottom. How cute is this? And it's got those um, bubbles that you pop in and then you pop out. I wish they had a yellow one because rubber duckies are yellow. But they could be pink, too. So that's really cute to hang on a backpack or keys. I then found this, which is a pop snapple bangle <coughs> excuse me and it is tie-dyed and they're all multicolors. every single bracelet was completely different from each other but i grabbed one and now i ain't no barbie doll but this one goes on my wrist just fine and i've been playing with it for probably two days now because i've had this dollar tree haul i think it's really cool and um it's definitely something to keep i think anyone's attention um, if it helps, by all means, go for it. And um, I grabbed a couple extra just to tuck away to have. This is called a flying sloth. So what you do, it says it's sticky and stretchy. Pull back and go, wee! Literally, it says, wee! And what you do is it sticks somewhere. So I'm going to save this for another time to do a product review if you want to see it or just to see it. Looks kind of like fun, you know, every now and then you need a good laugh. So I thought, yeah, that should be exciting. We'll give it a try. The other thing I found on the toy aisle, my bad. <laughs> you could call it a flute, a clarinet. Well, technically, no, it's not a flute. This would be more of a clarinet because it has more of a clarinet type style. They had blue, pink, green, red, yellow, purple. 
I think that's about it for colors. But what this is, it's a hard plastic. Oh, wow. And I guess I don't know if I just broke it or if it just comes apart. But anyways, it's supposed to be a little clarinet or a little horn. I am wondering if it really works. So we're going to test this together real quick. Let's see. Ooh, it really works, too. I'm going to try to play you a song. Hopefully that sounded something good. Alrighty, everybody, I'm gonna wrap up this Dollar Tree haul for tonight. I do have a couple fun finds. I'll give you guys a sneak peek. Until next time, everybody, thank you so much for watching and thank you so much for your support. Have a wonderful evening. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye for now.